An armil or armilla is a type of medieval bracelet, or armlet, normally in metal and worn in pairs, one for each arm. They were usually worn as part of royal regalia, for example at a coronation, or perhaps as part of especially grand liturgical vestments. They may have been worn outside ceremonies. Armili presumably descend from the ancient Roman armilla, which was a form of military decoration. These in turn seem to have developed from the armlets worn by some barbarian nations, including the ancient Celts and Scots. The form is variable, all three examples discussed below have completely different forms. Medieval survivals are vanishingly rare, much the most famous pair is now divided between the Louvre and the Germanisches National Museum in Nuremberg, having once been in the Hermitage Museum. These were found in the tomb of Andrei Bogolyubsky, Grand Prince of Vladimir Suzdal, in Vladimir, and may have been gifts from Emperor Frederick I Barbarossa, who received an embassy from the Grand Prince in 1165. They are high-quality Mohsen work in Champlevé enamel on gilded copper, showing the resurrection of Jesus and crucifixion. They probably fitted onto the shoulder, or otherwise would only go part way round the limb, and have holes by which they were presumably attached to thongs or bands, or sewn to the clothing below. It is thought they were made for wear by the emperor himself. A similar pair were drawn sometime before 1765, and described in a book published in 1790. They were then in the imperial treasury in Nuremberg, complete with their thongs for attachment, but they have since disappeared. These had scenes of the Nativity of Jesus and the presentation in the temple. It has recently been suggested that the enameled plates from the Monomachus crown in Budapest showing, but probably not made for, the Byzantine Emperor Constantine IX Monomachos, R. 1042-1055, may in fact come from an ermilla rather than a crown, as is normally assumed. These are gold plates, decorated with cloisonné enamel, but despite the lavish materials the workmanship is far from perfect, and the inscriptions contain simple errors, they were perhaps commissioned in a hurry for a special occasion. They were found in 1860 in a field in what is now Slovakia. The oldest surviving in the crown jewels of the United Kingdom, where they are usually called armils, are those of King Charles II, and the newest were created for the coronation of Queen Elizabeth II in 1953. The Elizabeth II armils were presented to the Queen by the governments of various Commonwealth nations and are single-piece round bracelets made of 22-karat gold lined with crimson velvet, with a concealed hinge and spring catch. However most British monarchs have not worn armils when crowned. The term armilla is used in the English Liber Regalis to describe a stole, like the Byzantine imperial loras, but this is thought to be a confusion as to the meaning of the word. 